It was great thanks Erica, here I am enjoying some powder and tea. Elsewhere in France, resorts have been enjoying excellent skiing, with lots of snow falling in the past week. Great visibility on Thursday afforded good views across most areas. In Switzerland, pieces are in good shape and pockets of fresh powder can still be found. Ski club leader Brian Horn has been showing members the best of Wengen all week. Nearby, Italian resorts have seen plenty of snowfall, with the Dolomites boasting some of the best conditions anywhere in the world at the moment. Glorious sunshine in Austria on Thursday allowed skiers to make the most of fantastic conditions and recent snowfall. Conditions in the Alps couldn't be better in preparation for half term, and with sunshine expected for most of the week, skiers can look forward to a fantastic trip. It's been cold in Colorado recently, with temperatures down to minus 20. Ski club leaders report fantastic conditions both on and off piste, in Breckenridge and Aspen. In Canada, Whistler received light snow this week, although it was quite soft lower down. More snow is expected over the weekend and into next week. A big dump of snow in Scotland means that all resorts currently offer excellent skiing. Good weather forecast over the weekend and into next week bodes well for half-term skiers and boarders. Now lots of people talk to me about little problems they've got with the fit and the feel of their boots. So here's some tips that'll hopefully help you out. Shin bang can be quite common and can be a real problem for men where the hairs get pulled, take away bits of skin and make it really raw. I know it sounds odd but shaving the shin before you go skiing can make a big difference. But if you're not comfortable with that then second skin such as this, a tagadum, provides that sliding layer, makes it more comfortable. There are ski specific versions like Ski Angel a bit of gel padding that goes down the front. Most boots have some sort of static velcro strap. You can replace it with an elasticated booster strap. Again, alleviates a bit of shin bang and gives a boot a really nice smooth rebound. If you find you can get a bit of space around the liner, you can pad it out with a bit of material or stick on foam. But if you're not comfortable doing that, then visit a good ski shop where they can help you. And before you butcher the boot, cut bits out, definitely go to the ski shop because once you've done it, you can't change it back and also it'll affect the warranty. <laughs>